Hello everyone. Normally, to open the game bar you would hit the Windows key plus T however, the Xbox game bar shortcut no longer works. In this video, we will show you how to fix Xbox game bar not working in Windows 11. Method 1. Enable the bar from settings. Press the Windows key plus I to open the settings app. Then click on the gaming option from the left panel. Then click on Xbox game bar from the right side. Once you're inside the Xbox Game Bar menu, enable the toggle associated with the Open Xbox Game Bar using this button on a controller option. Once you've completed the steps above, restart your computer and wait for the next startup to complete. Method 2. Reset the Xbox Game Bar component. Press the Windows key plus I to open up the settings window. Then select the apps option from the left panel. Click on apps and features from the red right side. Scroll down and find the Xbox Game Bar app. Then click on the three-dot icon associated with it and choose Advanced Options. Inside the Advanced menu, scroll down to the Reset tab and click on Reset. Method 3. Enable the feature in Registry Editor. Press the Windows key plus R to open up a run dialog box, then type in Regedit. Click OK. Go to the following path. Find the App Capture Enabled key. Double click on App Capture Enabled and ensure the base is set to hexadecimal and the value data is set to 1. Lose the registry editor and reboot your PC. Method 4. Repair the iframe.dll file. Open command prompt as administrator. Once you are inside the elevated command prompt, type or paste in the following commands one by one and press enter after each. Once the processes have been successfully run, reboot your PC and see if the Xbox Game Bar functionality has been restored. Method 5. Enable Xbox Game Bar in Local Group Policy Editor. Press the Windows key plus R, then type in pdot.msc, and click OK. Go to the following path. Find Windows Game Recording and Broadcasting. Double click on the Enables or Disables Windows Game Recording and Broadcasting and switch the toggle to Enable then click on Apply to save the changes made. Reboot your PC and see if the Xbox Game Bar functionality has been restored. 